Hi, in this course we will understand the use of having clause in SQL. The having. The having clause was added to SQL because the where keyword could not be used with aggregation functions. Having syntax. First, select columns from table where condition group by column names having condition order by column names. Now consider the query select star from table name employee info. Now we just need to rearrange this query and then where condition current status is not not null and current status uh, not empty string so and then we will use the group by clause group by clause first name if I have first name last name and then gross salary And then order by what do you are order by first name ASC. Now we will uh, add this column in here. And select method, select statement. Sorry, so. Now run this query. Yes, this is working. Now we can ag add aggregation function. Yes, you have sum total gross salary to total gross gross salary. Here we need to add as. Now this is the uh, group by clause if i if we want to see the uh, sum of gross salary more than 200 first uh, so we if we use this in where clause greater than 200 and now execute this yes an aggregation may not appear in where clause because the where clause does not allow to write uh, to um, seek the condition for aggregation function this is some aggregation so we can resolve this uh, problem by using uh, having clause having clause we need to write after group by clause having 200 this is having clause now run this yes this is working because the having clause do not having clause is used to resolve the aggregation function problem to check the condition instead of higher condition so in this way we can uh, use the having clause in sql thank you